It is estimated by the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention that about 1,500 people under the age of 25 die every year from sudden cardiac arrest, or C uh, SCA. Now, in today's HealthCast, we meet two South Dade sisters who are working really hard to raise awareness about this by sharing their own near-death story. We just feel super lucky to be alive. And Seven years ago, sisters Bethany and Hannah Keim were diagnosed with a heart condition called hypertrophic cardiomyopathy. It's a genetic abnormality that increases the risk of sudden cardiac arrest. When I was diagnosed, um, my doctor told me immediately I had to stop playing um, sports. I had to stop dancing because it was too much of a risk um, because of the growth of my heart. But this is one of the more common causes of sudden cardiac death in young people. As there hearts became more enlarged, the girls underwent surgery for implantable defibrillators. This is what a defibrillator looks like. Um, this is what it looks like on a chest x-ray. So basically the device sits under the skin up by the shoulder. There's some cables that run into the inside of the heart. And the ideal scenario is that we identify somebody that's at risk before something ever happens. The device has saved Hannah from four different episodes. One caught on camera during a performance in high school back in 2017. Um, it's not a pleasant experience. I describe it almost as a sledgehammer hitting a home run on your chest. It really knocks the wind out of you. Without a defibrillator, if somebody has one of those events, then it turns into what's called sudden cardiac death. And then you're counting on CPR from first responders, treatment and hospitalization, and even with all the best treatment, those outcomes are frequently not good. The sisters have turned their diagnosis into a desire to help and support others through a special Instagram page called Heart Charged. It's crazy. Every week we get somebody from around the world that thanks us for doing what we do and what we share on Instagram at Heart Charge, and it's just incredible. It's been a great experience being able to connect with all these people. Awesome young ladies right there. While in general, heart screenings aren't really recommended for young people, they are critical for those who have some sort of a known family history of heart conditions.